All right, YouTube, I just want to kind of take a second to just go, you know, maybe go into tree biology a little bit with you. I don't know, but we had a major bark inclusion in there. Like as you guys seen, it was a co-dominant stem here. Um, there's the bark inclusion right there. And uh, look at how bad it is. It cracks all the way through there and, you know, so, you know, if you guys got uh, heavily forked trees and co-dominant, you know, they're very dangerous. So you guys might consider getting rid of them or doing something with them, so. Just a little biology lesson. I'll put you guys on my hard hat because I imagine that stuff's going to split in pieces. That right there, folks, is why the bark inclusions are dangerous. Okay, so you, you see the taper on the log here, how big it is right here and let's look here watch out joy so look let's look at how big this log is and how it comes down to the fork and how it just thins out okay so that's why we want to get rid of your co-dominant trees or maybe consider cabling them or something like that because no bueno that's why this homeowner got rid of theirs you know and that and a little bit of basil rot down in there but prime example of included bark folks there's your today's biology lesson look at all the larvae 